Hey everyone, Zef here and welcome to VR1 Overview. Well, this looks completely different from most of the titles I've seen at the store. Uniqueness is a hard to find trait nowadays, though for virtual reality, because it's like a new medium or technology, it's easier to get your creative juices pumping and just release it in form of your own projects. So We Are One is a puzzle shooter action game where in a one-man army setting you clone your own body to fight against the machines and to represent the destructive nature of mother nature. This seems something special and kind of new because it's borrowing the concept of last clockwinder though it puts more an emphasis on action thing and I'm pretty sure the mechanics will be somewhat similar that you have to record your movement or it's gonna play in the loop constantly and then you fill in the blanks what needs to be done in the level. If not I'm very curious to find out what's going on with the mechanics. The art style is very intricate and specific kind of like a mixture of heavy cell shading and I don't know like animated drawings essentially. It's gonna be interesting to see the potential and the limits of it. It has a puzzle nature so there is some specific way to accomplish whatever task the game throws at you but it's just visually stunning and one of a kind so let's play some mind games. Where's everyone? <laughs> Such an adorable little one. And so eager, too. Already playing around and... Oh, you can't see? How rude of me. I'm sorry. Now you should be able to see me. <laughs> I'm over here. Oh my, you seem a little baffled down there. <laughs> of course, I'm such a dummy. I created you just moments ago. You know... Everything around here is my creation. From these huge trees to these small lovely flowers. And you, my little Sproutling, you are a special one. But let's start slowly, okay? How about you throw some of these fruits around? Ah, wait. I will quickly make some more for you. Throw them to this little plant over there. I mean... In terms of the art style, I love it. Like, it's exactly the same from the trailer. Nothing's like bad. The close-ups are like, you know, hard contours on the environment and then in the distance it gets like more blurry, like in real life essentially, so... Perfect. <laughs> Good job. You learn very fast. <laughs> this plant over there is called seedling. It allows you to make multiple clones of yourself while bending the time. <laughs> A bit confusing, isn't it? Ah, I'll show you. But first you need to be in my hands in order to grow in another place. Focus on your left hand and grab the mushroom to get back onto my hands right away. Grab and hold the mushroom with your other hand. Up here you should have a much better overview. Oh, and look! Down there is another Sproutling. Do you recognize it? This is your own clone. That was you a moment ago. <laughs> Exciting, right? Now try to grow on the seedling. Focus on that. Every move you did before is now replicated by your clone Sproutling. Try to catch these fruits you were throwing before. You know, a seedling helps you to create a time loop in which your clones exist. Time rewinds and everything happens all over again. <laughs> I know, I know. It's a lot. <laughs> Do I need to reset? I feel like the movement cause I was just doing some... Bullshit. Can I do that? Like... Huh? <laughs> it took some time. But I'm sure you can already handle some machines. Grab the dandelion and let's go, shall we? I just need to notice when was the sequence start, cause... 
it wasn't very obvious and I wonder if I can do it like manually. I wanted to show you something, my dear child. Do you see these tree tappers over there? These things clinch onto my trees and harm them. They drain them empty till my precious trees are parched and lifeless. I am defenseless against them. But you are not, my little Sproutling. Try to focus on the seedling with the fruit laying around and throw them to your future self, just like before. By the way, these are blast fruits, a special kind of fruit bursting with energy. They are very effective against the machines, so be careful. Come back into my hands when you are ready. You can use the blast fruit directly or in combination with a shoot branch. If you look close to the second seedling, you will find one. The shoot branch only works when you put a blast fruit, the energy source, into it. With this, you are able to destroy the tree tappers over there. Very good, my little sproutling. Now you know how to fight against these annoying machines, and soon you will be ready to start your own big journey. Now, let's find other tree tappers, all right? It's so cool. Though I still don't know when it started. Like, I really need to either do it immediately or maybe there's gonna be like a reset button later. There, more of these harvester things. Don't forget. With each seedling, you relive the same time loop, but in another place. That means you can directly work together with your past and future self. How is this possible, you ask? Well, us beings of nature live in an intertwined ecosystem, allowing us to experience time and space a bit more flexible than these cold, rusty machines. Time loops don't really affect these things. Oh, I didn't lose those two. Good job, my little Sproutling. <laughs> There's like a time, I guess. I have some unexplained things still, but yeah, this is like exactly the same concept of Last Clockwind Door, though there it was more clear when things start and finish. This situation looks a bit trickier. There are two tree tappers, but only one shoot branch. I suggest you work together closely with your own little helpers. And don't forget, with each clone sproutling, you are reliving the same time loop. Everything happens again, and sometimes you have to be a bit patient. Okay. <laughs> you shared the same shoot branch with your past self. Very clever. Well, I will try to hold back a little more from time to time to let you gain experience on your own. But don't worry. <laughs> you got time and your clones on your side. I like love this. There's nothing bad I can say about it. It's just everything's correct so far. Okay, so she will stop telling me tips. The pedal show how many shots are left. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> this is like the time for the whole sequence. My little Sproutling. And there's also leaderboards and high scores. There is just the right amount of stuff going on. Oh wow. <laughs> Could have been done probably with less shots and stuff, but I'm just having fun. What's the saying? Put the pedal to the metal. I didn't expect them to be here already. This thing is a lumberjack. Its kind cuts down all my trees and destroys anything in its path. I must warn you, my little Sproutling. They have a bad habit of being fairly aggressive. They will try to hurt you, so please watch out. Aye, aye. <laughs> Can you do it again? Some Matrix stuff. You stopped them. I'm so proud of you. Though it is strange that there are lumberjacks so deep in the forest. Well, anyway, let's continue on, shall we? I'm good though, because the concept is clear, the mechanics, like, everything. <laughs> I like love this, it's so easy to pick up, to learn what's going on, like with the time loops and stuff. The art is amazing, the narration is there, like, there's just literally everything possible and good going on for it, so no need to speculate, it's just amazing. That's it, nothing to add. <laughs>